the fuck are you? What are you, like the ghost of the bad mother I just killed? Okay. I'm not sure if I'm ready for this. I just barely had one fight. I'm not ready for a second one. Everybody, welcome back. Falcon, Neil Scavenger Extended Mod. We are looking at this motherfucker right here with his Wolverine Black Whiskey Bottle. You better have drank that whiskey bottle, or that better have some whiskey left over, because if it doesn't, you and me are going to tangle. I came back to my campsite right now to, or I was planning to come back here to, you know, just disinfect some of the water so we could take care of our parched issue. And then when I got here, this motherfucker's right here. He probably saw a fire and he was like, oh, there's some fire over there, let me warm myself up. So, you know what, you picked the wrong campsite, my friend, because if you don't amscrew the fuck out of here, it's going to be a problem. So, I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt. And I'm just going to offer to talk. But, I'll tell you right now, if you don't fuck off, then there's going to be problems. So let's offer to talk to him. Oh! It's a bad mother, so he's not going to go anywhere. He's going to want to fight me, and more importantly, he's going to want to kill me and eat me afterwards. But that's fine, because he probably has some good items on him. Now mind you, I am not a melee class, so we're going to be kind of in a tough spot right now. So we have to wait one turn because he's charging at me and I decided to talk to him. And let's see, he pelted me with a glass bottle. What? Why is he bleeding? <laughs> oh, because he's using a broken bottle to attack me. Gotcha. But that's fine. It's okay for him because he's a bad mother. It's not good for me because I'm not necessarily the most, I guess, like, um, melee-friendly class here. So what I'm going to need to do is actually run away if I can. Because, so oh, what happened to my text over here? Why is it so small? There we go. <laughs> Taco message font size, that got really small there for a second. Uh, player's bleeding, and his whiskey bottle fell apart, so now he has to start punching me, and that's okay, because if he starts punching me, he's just gonna have to get really close to do that, and that's fine, because I have the broad spear stab, so I have the range advantage. So, let's start off by doing a melee attack number one. Alrighty, motherfucker. So, player cut bad mother's upper stomach with a broad spear stab, player's bleeding, and he's bleeding too. I don't know how bad my cut is, let me look in here, oh, fuck. It's kind of bad. Do... Let me see about going over here for a second, putting this on. Let me put this on my cut. There we go. Let's stop the bleeding here for a second. We do have amoxicillin too, right? We do have the amoxicillin and... I thought we had another pill too. I guess I was wrong. Oh, no, no, yeah. Amoxicillin, that's the only thing we have, huh? Oh, we had initially some... Oh, we have morphine. <laughs> you know, if the pain gets so bad, we could always do that. But either way, let's go back into the fight menu here. He is um, up close in my face again, so let me just run away. Okay, so... Bad Mother's parrying for an attack? Good. You go ahead and do that, because I'm going to just um, fall back one space here. He ran towards me. Let's um run back. Again, we need to keep distance from him. We're at five away now, which is pretty good. So... I'm burdened now, too, huh? Interesting. That's probably because I'm parched, though. So, five away. Excellent. So, what I'm going to do is, I need him to come rush towards me, so I'm going to keep dropping back one. There we go. So, now he is in perfect range for a melee attack here. Player slash bad mother's lower stomach with a broad spear stab. So, we got him again, and he is on the ground. Looking like a fool with his pants on the ground, or at least he wasn't on the ground. Okay, so now we're going to do this again. Player cut bad mother's upper chest with a broad spear stab. Alrighty, and he's uh, pretty close now, so let me once again run back. Excellent. Three away is perfect. We will go into... Oh, he's threatening me? Oh, oh, I'm so scared. Oh, oh, bad mother, you and your fist are so terrifying. I'm over here fucking piercing your ass with a broad spear stab. Do you think I'm scared of you, dick, just because I can't do melee attacks so well? No, man. I'm a Neo Scavenger survivor here, bro. Let me go into a melee surge and just fuck you up. How about that? Coughing up blood. Oh, yeah. You want to threaten me now? Huh? Try it. Oh, he's actually up close in front of me now. That's kind of terrifying. <laughs> I should probably stop shit-talking so much. Uh, player cut. Bad mother's upper right arm with a broad spear stab. Player grabs bad mother's upper left arm with a broad spear stab. I'm bleeding. He's bleeding. Waiting for a movement. Player's bleeding. Bad mother's bleeding. So what I'm going to do now is do a little lore here. Um, bad Mother has fallen to the ground and must regain footing to continue. Exposed easy for attack. Armor was barely affected. Lower right leg was slashed. Alrighty, and I'm tired now, so that could start becoming an issue, just being the fact that I'm tired here. We still have one range away, which I would rather just run back if I can then. Perfect. 
And let me just go into another melee attack here. Player cut Bad Mother's lower left leg with a broad spear stab. Bad Mother's in severe pain and having trouble concentrating. Excellent. Now he's up here in my face one more time. So, we run back. Bad Mother's dodging out of the way, making him hard to hit for a moment. Yeah, you go ahead and parry or dodge whatever you want. Let me go for attack again. I cut his lower left arm with a broad spear stab. I mean, I'm fucking him up. He's just gonna take a lot of damage because of the tough trade over here. Let me run back one more time. Again, if we want to survive this, we need to be as far away as possible and get these attacks in from afar. Has fallen to the ground. Oh, I missed my attack. That's unfortunate. But he's on the ground now, right? He totally is. So, let's do a melee search. He's unconscious. So, I cut him in the lower chest. I graze his right arm. He's unconscious, falling to the ground, and he's passed out from unbearable pain. Excellent. So, we were able to win this one. Let me just go advance over here, and we are going to just stab this motherfucker in the head. Oh, I'm gonna kill him, believe me I am. Fuck that. Motherfucker. So, he's dead now. And we're gonna take everything that he has, so, oh god. I hope we didn't lose much items because of the fact that our thing was loaded up here. I hope, I really hope that's not the case. I don't think he had a bag on him though, so what I'm gonna do here is momentarily... How do I destroy items again? Three. Let's, uh, boom, 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 boom. Don't want to destroy that fire. I need that. Okay. So, let's see here. He has a right shoe, 52, minus 47, so we're going to take that one. And he has a left one, too. Perfect. He has the pair. Alrighty, so we're no longer uncomfortable because we're actually wearing two pairs of shoes now, or at least a pair of shoes completely. I'm going to hold on to the cargo pants. I could butcher this guy down and eat him if I wanted to, but... Maybe not the best idea right now. I'm going to take this with me for now. If anything, I'll just break it down for string, because we're going to need string anyway. And that's about it. So we didn't really get much out of fighting him, but we kind of needed to do that. And again, I could eat him, but I don't necessarily want to go down the cannibal pad, because um, it starts messing with you down the line, like pretty bad. And I don't necessarily want to go through that again. So he's dead. Perfect. Now, we do have our water. We need to take care of our parched issue and the fact that we are tired. So we're going to probably rest in this town after we're done. So what I'm going to do is end my turn, number one. And secondly, we're going to go into crafting menu here. And let's see, where is the purified water? If I'm right, it should be here. Sterilized water, perfect. Clear it out. Do it again. Clear it out. Water, water. Clear it out, and... Sterilize water, so we don't need to necessarily sterilize this one because it's already sterilized. So you could go away, you can go away. We'll just sterilize this bad boy, confirm and clear. Alrighty, so now we're gonna drink all this and get our parched issue under control. We'll probably have to go back and get some more water for our journeys ahead, but for now, we just wanted to take care of our issue. And that's good. Our thirst is sated. We'll take that clean one, and that's about it here. We're just tired now, which is understandable. But at least we're warm by the fire and everything else. The amoxicillin, I'm not sure if I should take it yet. I don't think the... The injury was that crucial that I'm going to need to take it right now. I can't, I can't know that without the medic skill, which I don't have this time around, but hey. Alright, so we are done here. I'm going to jump into the marsh one more time, though. And that is because we want more of this water to disinfect. Okay. And let's go back out of here. We'll end our turn one more time, and we'll probably jump back to the town and sleep there. Thankfully, we don't have the insomnia trait this time around, so... What the fuck are you? What are you, like the ghost of the bad mother I just killed? Okay. I'm not sure if I'm ready for this. I just barely had one fight. I'm not ready for a second one. I'm gonna just, um... I don't know, do a... Uh, take cover, I guess? He's trying to flee. Okay, that's good. Um, what if I just reveal myself and talk to him? Is he, like, maybe not a bad guy? Stranger gets up. Were you sleeping here? I could lure away. Oh, that's pretty interesting. Lures the target one space away from you. Will distract target for one turn. Must see target and target must not see you. Ah. Well, I don't necessarily want to fight him. I just want to maybe talk to him. Maybe he's not a bad dude. Well, I won't know that anymore because he's gone now. That's okay. I prefer that way. Oh, he's back now. He's back with friends. 
Possibly, friends. Uh, I'm, I'm not visible to this guy. Nor am I visible to this guy. Okay. Here's what we do. We're not going to reveal ourselves. Fuck that. I think that we could probably purify this water elsewhere. Do you think that's a good idea? I think that's a good idea. So you know what? <laughs> Fuck that. We're done here. I'm going to just sneak away. And maybe they'll fight themselves. Stranger's taking cover. Stranger takes cover from player. Okay, that other guy's gone now. He doesn't see me yet, which is good, so I'm going to continue sneaking away. There, it's daytime. We have some light now. Let's get the fuck out of here. I don't like it here anymore. Where's the map at? Okay, we're going to go maybe that way over here. Now, mind you, we're tired, so we need to get some rest soon. Thankfully, our hunger hasn't been really kicking our ass yet, so I'm thankful for that. There's nothing over here. Just like a field we could scavenge here, but why do that? So let's just keep going down this way. I'm going to probably jump into some woods right now. That's okay. You know, we wanted to purify water anyway, right? So, let's go into the crafting menu. Actually, no. Let's go over here and we will use this to make some wood. Again, the travel is something I want to build as well, but we need to find some better... better condition strength to make that happen. Otherwise, we get a really shitty travel is going to break down on us like in a few turns, so what's the point of that? Um... So let me go... What do I need to do now? I wanted to purify the water. So let's go over to... Ba -ba -ba -ba. Friction. We'll have to use the newspaper for it. Ah, uh, yeah, I guess. I want to use that for arrows, but... Sure, why not? I could always get a newspaper later on anyway. Let's go into stoked. Excellent. I don't necessarily need to stoke the fire to, you know... Purify water. I just do it just because I'm used to doing it. Force of habit, I guess you could say. Alright, so boil water, clear. Boil water, clear. That's all we're going to do for this turn, unfortunately. So we have to end turn here, and next turn we'll purify the rest of it. Player is wary. Player is carrying a moderate load. That's only because we're wary now, so yeah, it's becoming an issue. We do need to get some rest kind of soon. But before we do that, let me go back into sterilizing the rest of this water. That's already sterilized? I sterilized all of it already. Huh, seems like I did. Okay. So, fill that up, fill that up, and there you go. Alright, so, water is good. We're decent on that. Now, it becomes an issue with getting some rest, and we need to get some rest in a decent spot, because, remember, we do have the sleeper skill, which means we're a heavy sleeper, reduced awareness when sleeping, so maybe even our noise traps will not help us if somebody wants to loot us during nighttime. So, we need to find somewhere that's going to be kind of relatively okay for us to kind of, um... Dig in here. There is a shack over here, so let me check this out before we go somewhere else. I'll use the mechanic skill because otherwise I get fucked and I'm not too happy about that. Gray shirt. I think we already have three shirt stacks, so we're fine. Another leather utility belt. Can I stack more than one? No. So, I guess we don't necessarily need it after all then, do we? I guess not. I don't want that. You know what? We could essentially break some of this down for the travois, though, so let me destroy some of these items here. <gasps> oh, yeah, that's so funny now, isn't it? The run that I don't have the insomnia trade, we ran into the fucking Zapidim. That's funny. The game's a funny guy sometimes. Um, handful of flour. I have enough. I'm not even sure what it's used for just yet, so I'm not going to take that one right now. Okay. What I wanted to do is break down some of this stuff for string. So let me go into the grafting menu here really quickly. We'll probably be able to get the travel up and... Oh, no, I... No, I can't. What I need to do is break down some of these shirts into string. So we'll confirm that and clear that. And then we'll use 63, sure. Clear that out. Anything else over here? 38 isn't really that great. Yeah, not really that great. 84 is actually pretty good. Firm and clear. That's the one that I'm wearing, at, presumably. Oh, no, that's the other one. Mine is 65, and this one's 38, so yeah, I like mine better. Now, what can you break down the leather belt for, out of curiosity? Leather belt, where are you at? Where's the extra one at? Where the fuck is it? Ice slab battery, that's from the iPad over here. Do I not just see it? Or do you not use the leather thing as a... Really surprising? Is it because it's like part of the mod that he can't use it in the ingredients? Could be it. I don't see it unless I'm just completely blind, which is, you know, more than feasible. Yeah, I don't see it. Alrighty, well, you know, what can we do? 
So, if we go to the crafting menu now, we could drop down a lot of the string over here. 63 is, you know, passable. Not really great, but it's passable. 63, sure, let's just make a few 63s. You know what? If my travel was a 63%, I wouldn't mind one bit. That's all we can make. So, here comes the really boring part, unfortunately. That is, even though I wanted to do this off-camera, we have the chance to do it now, so I might as well take advantage of it. So, let me rearrange this really quickly. I guess I should probably do it in the crafting menu. So, what I want to do... Move all these guys here, number one. And then bring them over here. Is that all of them? Yes. We need to split these dudes up. We're going to stack those dudes there. We're going to go into known recipes and just go into the travois. Keep the 12. Condition 63.7. I'll take it. So, confirm, clear it out. Alright, so it took a while, but we have the travois up and running too. Excellent, so... Uh, this is going to make it harder for us to... We're not going to be able to run away in battle with this, but you know, that makes sense, and... Players carrying a moderate load and their movement rate is slower. That's because we're um, tired, though we need to get some rest. Players pulling a slow with a string that allows them to carry more. Player cannot run in combat. Understandable. So now that we have that, though, we could come over here, and I'm going to take this. Oh, I can't use it because, yeah, right. Um, we don't have the electrician skill, so I don't think it's really that worth it. I don't think you can do much with the mechanics skill if I'm right. So I'm going to take it just for now, but I will dump it off the moment I get the chance. Can I... can't stack those either, huh? What the fuck can I put into Trovall, then? Just big items? Yeah. Only big items, but that's fine. We... At least it's there. At least we know it's there, ready to go. That's about it. Let me just stack these dudes over here. We'll purify those when we need to, in case we get some more cuts later on, and that's about it. I don't necessarily want to take that with me. Alrighty. Anything else I need to do here? Purify anything? Burn anything? Cook anything? No. Alright. So, resting. We need a rest, though. Let me jump over here, and here there's a area over here that we could probably explore. Outside temperature is actually getting pretty cold. Like, you know, possible hypothermia cold, so we gotta be careful with that one. Let me scavenge over here really quickly. A storage shed. Mechanic, just in case. We found another flare. Oh, and a monkey wrench. I love the monkey wrench. It's really, really strong, but the thing is you have to be really up close to the enemy to land that hit in there. <laughs> we already have one of those, but we'll take another one. Sure, why not? And can you stack more than one flare? Or more than two? You could stack up three at the very least. That's a terrible condition, and... Tell me I could put this in here. Yes. Per. Okay. And, yeah, I might as well take that. You know what? We could actually get the... Um, extension for that, if I'm right. And what I mean by that is I'll show you really soon. It's the telescope is what I'm trying to get, so we get better, like, um, distance view. See mechanics go over here, nothing found. All right, let me go into my crafting menu. Oh, we have no more turns left, unfortunately, so... And turn here. Outdoor temperature, stop being a dick. Oh. Search the area. Search the area. It's a stranger again. Let me try talking to this guy now if you get the chance. Oh, I can't. I could only really taunt him. Well, what if I don't want to fight him? Is he a bad dude? I'm not sure. Let me offer a ceasefire. Okay, he booked it. That's fine. I'll take that as well. Let me go into the crafting menu here, and we want to use telescope along with string. And that would make the scope with strap? Oh, really? 2.2? Fuck, I, I hate this string so much. So fucking much. I need to destroy that terrible string, huh, by the way. I don't gotta tell you that, but I really do. 61, 59. 2.2. 44. 6.6. .6, alrighty. Can I destroy you here and now? Yes. Okay. That one could go fuck itself. Where's 2.2 at? Go fuck yourself. And then 44, 19. Uh oh. Tolerate 9. Actually, you know what? Nope. And nope. So 61, 44. This will give me what? A condition of 44.8? I could increase the value of this, but then again, I probably won't sell this. I could have probably used like the high condition one to sell a really high condition telescope somewhere else, but. I really hold on to this anyway, so let's just do that, clear it out, and we'll have our telescope up and running. Sweet. Now that's going to give us a longer draw distance in the map, and good. Good, good. Am I leaving any importance here? Not really. So now we just need to find a place to sleep. 
I have some tarps with me, so I could essentially make a little tarp shelter for the night. Oh, it's probably the same dude again. I'm gonna do his blind retreat over here. I don't necessarily want to fight him. It doesn't seem like he's actually going to cause issues towards us, but it's just being a pain in the ass running into him on occasion. Men in house? We could probably sleep here. However, do I want to sleep here with that dude around? That's the real question, and I really can't tell you. I, I'd rather not do that because he seems like he might mug us overnight. But we just might have to. 78. Okay, we found some better condition pants here. We're going to take those. Okay. But that, am I not? I guess you can't wear the gown after a while. I guess I could break down the gown for something of importance. And let's see. Can I stack up to four? I definitely can. We have a flashlight, too. A charge flashlight. Excellent. Put that over there. All right. Pretty, pretty good. And my turn. There's a few more areas to scavenge here. Now, if I decide to sleep here, we'll have to make a noise trap. And hope that I will wake up, even though I have the sleeper trade if I'm looted at night by that asshole that's wandering around. So let me go in here and see about making a noise trap if we can. We should be able to, but... The noise trap is not here, so I have to make it myself. That's fine. If I'm right, all we do need is some bottles, string, and pebbles. That should just about do it. Where is my dragon? Now, where where are the rest of my items out of curiosity? Like, I know I have a lot more items than this, don't I? Yeah, like, this isn't showing up in the crafting menu. Why is that? Yeah, I have a lot more ingredients than this. What, where's, what's happening to everything else? Like, it's really important that I... Okay. This shows up, right? So I'm going to have just a makeshift with that. <laughs> I have no choice at this point. So there you go. Noise trap. Just because I have to. 36 is not really great condition. It's because one of these strings is probably terrible. No? Is it because of the pebble? Is the pebble the one? Is the, the culprit over here? Oh, I have a shitty pebble now. Is that what you're telling me? No, no, I mean, 15 condition, 24 condition. I'm not sure what dictates that, the noise trap value. And you know what? I don't even care. Just clear it out and make it. All right, so we have one noise trap. Good. Let me go into the trap wall, place you over here for now. I would like to have one more of those, but it's not happening, it seems. Let me just empty this out. Yeah, these fucking bottles aren't showing up. It is kind of annoying. Now, here's the thing. They would show up here, right? Because that item was over here, and this showed up. So what if I go to the crafting menu now? Bottle is still not there. I'm sorry if I'm having, like, the massive brain fart, and you guys are screaming at the screen that I'm missing something so fucking obvious, but I, I really am. <laughs> I'm not even fucking around. This is so weird. Let me go to the noise trap. You know what? Our known recipe should be here, right? So what if I just went over here and did the noise trap now? I don't want to reverse it. Yeah, it only shows me the available ingredients. That's so weird, dude. I'm not sure what the problem is. Okay, whatever. One noise trap it is. We just need to rest anyway, so... We might as well do it here. Even though it's daytime. I hate resting in daytime because, you know, I could be moving about. But whatever. Let's go into... Menus here. We have a storage shed. Shelter. Kind of eh. This one's a lot better, so we'll use that. Let me drop you over here. You should be in a backpack, by the way, because it makes it a lot easier to use you then. Like, what if I place you here and then move this shit? Oh, oh god damn it. I don't even need you. Fuck you. <laughs> Simple as that. Fuck yourself. I don't even need you. So let me go into this, and alertness went up. Perfect. That'll do. Oh, yeah, now you show up. Oh, speaking of which, you should probably go back into where you probably were, at least nearby, because I do need you after all. And same thing with you. Might as well hold on to you if I can. And coffee... Sorry I had to ruin your container there, but I had no other choice, and that's about it. So let's go in here, and alertness, let's get some sleep. Let's get rid of this weariness at the very least. Alrighty, I woke up, had trouble falling asleep. Do I have insomnia? Oh, come on. I don't have it. I have sleeper, I somehow woke up. Is that because there was somebody around? Well, I don't know. Let me try to sleep again, though I'm worried now, but... Give it another try here. It feels so good to be able to fucking sleep whenever you want, as opposed to, like, dealing with insomnia over and over. 
Okay, um, is that enough? No, I want to rest a bit more, if you don't mind, since I have the option to do so, finally. Okay, keep going. Hungry and thirsty, that could be a problem. Hey, wake your ass up already, dude. <laughs> You're sleeping way too long now. Hungry and thirsty. Okay, we can take care of that. We have water. Hunger is the thing that's going to probably kick us in the ass because we have no way of getting berries properly and we're going to probably have to hunt for food soon. Which is fine. It's perfectly capable of happening. Alrighty, so we're done here. I am going to get everything out of here and we're going to call it an episode here. I'm making these a little bit longer just because I don't release Neo Scavenger as often as some people would like, so I do apologize for that. I'm trying to work on a schedule where I don't have to spread episodes out too long, but the thing is that I don't necessarily want to release like more than two videos a day, at least on the weekdays. On the weekends I do three videos a day, but on the weekdays I just do two because I don't want to necessarily flood people's feed with a bunch of videos. It's just not my style. I know a lot of other YouTubers do that, but I don't know. It seems like diminishing returns to me. But either way, I'm trying to figure something else in terms of uh, releasing Neil Scavenger more frequently, but at least for now I'm making this a little bit longer as you can see, just to kind of um, at least play KG for a while. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up, leave a like. The support does me a lot. Other than that, I will catch you next time.